Now swap it forward and as you say, we will imagine that does go the way of Lanham and you can see Lanham there says, give me that Axe, there we have it. So you got the Axe on Naga as well now. And then Push comes in, Matumaman tried to jump onto Ori, but the fish are keeping them on the wrong side of one another. They find the concoction onto Matumaman in rage, backs off, will be able to save himself from most of the damage, Deathlord gets laid down, but they're keeping the distance. Ori just man fighting at the front, trying to finish off these racks. The fortification comes through, the nullifier out on Tori, but there's the song with the Aghanim's heal. Look at this health on this DK. Ori just straight back up to two thirds. Now they're jumping again. Miracle trying to commit, but the rift comes through. Eleven is ready to take the I know he says we can stick around, but they're fighting constant. They've lost the wisdom to NGH. Comes in with the Echo Slam. The Dragon Knight getting so low. Can they kill Ori off? Ori's still alive. They will fight it with a blast. They've taken down the Dragon Knight. Can they get more? Paparazzi looking towards Miracle. Miracle does get stunned up. They're chasing for the decrep. The life drain from Mind Control gets cancelled immediately by the concoction. Buyback come through from Ori. Ori wants to get himself back into this engagement. Concoction being charged up once again. By Paparazzi turns towards Mind Control, holds him down. Mind Control falling low. They've lost the Ursa for two minutes. Miracle buyback down. from Naga Siren. Miracle will buy back. The creeps down bottom are knocking onto the tier 4 towers with the Naga Siren. Lanham's there with the defense. The rest of VG Gaming can look to go in and finish off these objectives. They'll get the melee racks mid. No Ursa for 100, no GH Shaker for 50 seconds. The eight is timed out mid fight there on Ori. Otherwise, he could have actually survived a bit longer, but it doesn't matter. They know that the Earth Shaker's dead. They know that the Earth is down for 90 as well. They can go for the second set. They absolutely can. Look at the damage coming out from these three beefy boys. Look at the stun out. They're trying, but Miracle is caught in the center of it all. The BKB is out for Mori. There's the buyback. Matumaman has the buyback now. Available the sandbags there from Kuro, but it will cost him his life. Kuro has been self to by no mind control. Buys time for the save. Matumaman jumps in the midst of it all. Gets another fire out to 11, but Ori's back from the Shadow Blade. Turns towards the Spirit. Matumaman has the stun. Gets the kill. Mukuro will buy back, but then now lost. Matumaman off the back of a dieback. Miracle goes to so this Alchemist. The life trade's enough. They'll get the Alchemist, but buyback immediately from Bab Paparazzi, the song from Lanham, holding them in place. Mike Kuro gets the BKB off. Miracle trying to get himself back to base for the stuns. Holding down this BR, the four star. Kuro gets him back into safety. The fish are out onto two. Kuro dying in the fountain here from Paparazzi. He dives in. They've lost three, but Miracle is going for the base race. He's onto the tier four. They surely he can't do it in time, though. The, the speed the aura. of Fiji Gaming is taking this base is surely too much for Liquid. Miracle will find the tier fours, but the base of Liquid's falling. GH is going going in for the plate with a quick smooth dragon tail as Ori stands. Saki Gaming will be your first grand finalist here at ESL1 Katowice. At the end of the fight there, they're hitting the throne and everybody has plus 200 damage because of that Aghanim's Underlord. He had oh plus 395 goodness. on himself, so everybody else has plus about 190. Oh my god, I can't believe that BGP was able to hold off so long with their tanky cores making these fights last so long. This Underlord just became absolutely unkillable.